Next on our agenda, we're going to talk about tooling enhancements within Mastercam 2022. And the first thing I'm going to do is go over to my tool manager. And as soon as my tool manager opens up here, you'll notice a couple new features within the tool manager. We now have an assemblies tab, and we also have a holder filter option that's been added within the tool manager dialog here. Within each one of these tabs here, we also have our right click context window that relates to each one of the options within these tabs. And if I look at the holder filter options, you can now see that we can filter by manufacturer, we could filter by units or through coolant, and I can also filter by upper and lower connection by type and size. For now, I'm going to leave my filter active off here, and I'm going to create a simple tool assembly within Mastercam. Now we still have the option to create a basic tool within Mastercam, but for now, I want to create my tool assembly. We're going to add the holder and everything. For my assembly name, I'm going to call it Assembly Demo. And I want to go ahead and add a tool within our dialog here. So I have an undefined tool. Let's define this tool. And I'm simply going to create a half inch bullnose end mill. I'm going to say finish on this. And we can see our bullnose end mill has now been added. But I also want to add a holder. And instead of defining a holder, I'm going to import from a library. And I'll just randomly select a holder here. Now, we also have the option to add any kind of uh, extensions or uh, other holder components that may relate to our current assembly here. If I right click on my tool, we have the option to add component above and I can define another holder as well. And let's say that this is, I don't know, one inch by three inches by one inch. We'll have our extension here. I'll say OK. And let's rename this to uh, extend. And I can also go back and edit any functions within our holder here. So in this case I see this extension is not going to work. Let's edit this extension and we'll say we have a three-quarter extension. Finish. There we go. Now we can also adjust our projection here to the end of our tool or to the top of our shoulder there. And I can also independently move the holder itself with my extension in the assembly. For now, I'm going to leave this alone and I'm going to green check OK on this. And let's look at a brand new library here. I'll just call it new lib. And you'll notice we have no holders, no tools, and no assemblies that have been added in here. Which brings me back up to the top in our machine group. I want to right click and I'm going to look at this other option here for Save Assembly to Library. And within this option, I can save my tool assembly, I can save just the tools, or I can save the holders as well. For now, I'm going to save the full assembly. I'm going to green check OK. And our library has been updated. And now within this, I can see my full assembly. And if I go back to the top, Let's do each independent one now. So I'll save assembly from library and let's do just the holders. I'll green check OK. And now under our holder option you can see that I have my extension and I also have my holder itself. So from here let's go ahead and green check OK. And that's just some of the new features that Mastercam 2022 has to offer for our tooling enhancements to make creating assemblies a lot easier than what it has in the past. Hope you all enjoyed that, and thank you for watching.